Bonjour and welcome to a week of my life living in Paris. There you go. We're here. We're in Paris. I'm so excited. Okay, so basically, long story short, for those of you who don't follow me on Instagram and don't already know, I woke up one day and was like, you know what? I'm gonna move to Paris. I need a break from New York City. I also wanted to feel like re-inspired, so I just came to Paris and I had such a little time to prepare that like I showed up with no plans, just my suitcases, and we hit the ground running. And it's been a great time and I'm so excited to bring you guys with me. And I'm all dressed up because it is the morning and I'm about to go take some content, some pics, and I'm excited to bring you guys with me. So let's get the day started. and I need to get used to the public transport. But I wanna share my OOTD before we do anything. I did my makeup right there. Just vibes, honestly. We got a restructured suit, Gucci bag, fun loafers, jewelry. I'm proud of this one. It's a good one. So I'm on my way to the bus. And if you don't know anything about Paris, one thing you need to know is that the pickpocketing here is real. So I'm gonna kind of minimize how much I use my camera once I get outside. And the elevator's here. There we go. So the spot that I want to take photos and while I was walking up these stairs. So they look really beautiful, so let's go up. Okay, so this is how I plan my shoots. I have the location, example photos, outfit, and a list of photos that I want. So... I'm gonna look for more video ideas while I wait for my friend to come. And this is the result of my photo shoot. Stunning. Okay guys, I just got back to the apartment and I'm so hungry because I didn't eat dinner last night and I'm trying to fire up the stove and I realize I have no idea how it works and the pot isn't working. I mean, sorry, there, I bought pasta and there isn't a pot. Here's how it's going with the stove. I'm just hearing like a clicking noise. Hmm, I don't know, y'all. Do I give up? Let's try this. I just can't figure this out. And I'm like, okay. I bought these groceries being like, I'm gonna be healthy and cook a little bit. But guys, like I'm in Paris. Should I just eat? The food here is cheap. Should I just go to the store around the corner and get food? Let's see if this one great place is open. Okay, I need to find out if this place is open that I wanna go to. Shall I just go explore? I guess I'm not cooking. Let's go. for you just uh, two minutes. It's creep time. This is how it's done. That's how it's done. Mm. Oh, this is delicious. Okay guys, so I just spent the day working and I'm just gonna go for like a long walk and see the city. I haven't had the time to really do that, especially during the day. Paris is very, very rainy. Something I didn't really know. So let me tell you what I planned for our walk. First of all, because I had all those crepes today, I'm like in need of a good salad. Um, so I found the salad place and I was just looking at the way to get there and you have to pass the Louvre, the Petit Palais, and Notre Dame. But I also want to see the Dior exhibit. And apparently you can just walk in anytime. That's what I saw on the internet, so I hope that's true. And it's also kind of on the way if I just go a little bit on my way. If I'm inspired to stop anywhere along the way, I will bring you along. Maybe I'll stop for a little Aperol or something like that before I get to my salad. And then I'll grab my salad and come home to celebrate my anniversary with my boyfriend. Long distance life. Let's go. I'm wearing the same outfit I wore today because I think it's super cute. And we're gonna go for a little walk. What's in my bag for this little walk du jour? Let's go through it. 
We've got my mom's vintage Chanel wallet in the Chanel bag that kind of matches. We've got the Dior lip oil, light up the lip oil. Um, headphones to listen to Selena Gomez, of course. I don't know how this whole scan will turn me into a stand. The keys for this apartment, because there's only one set of keys, so I cannot leave the house without a set of keys. My tripod, which was confiscated from me in Spain because it's a stick. I don't know what that meant. My oversized Saint Laurent sunglasses that I'm always getting asked about. And I'm bringing a water bottle because I know I'm gonna get thirsty. This bag is literally perfection. I rented it from Vivrel and it fits everything I need for the day. Oh, and also the camera's going in there because I don't want it to get stolen. Yeah, you have to be really careful holding a camera out in Paris. I will be careful with you, camera today. Today's my one year with my boyfriend, so I wish he was here so we could do this together. But this is the bridge in Paris, if you don't know, where people lock their love forever. Okay guys, this is the Louis Vuitton store. It looks so cool right now. And then, I don't know if you guys saw in the news, but there was a protest where they like broke down the walls to the LVMH office that is the lvmh office right there the scene of the crime there's like a gate you can't even get anywhere close so crazy it looks like some people have tickets Okay guys, that whole experience at the exhibit completely exceeded my expectations because, I don't know, I guess I thought I was just going into like a small gallery and it was like a full museum. It was amazing. There, the dresses were just so gorgeous. The story was well told. I'm obsessed. Anyways, I see a dad taking a TikTok over there and it makes me want to go take one. Um, but yeah, the walk continues. Now I'm kind of just like thinking like, I want to sit down somewhere and have salad. It doesn't have to be a salad place. Um, so we'll see how that goes. Okay guys, quick update. I mentioned in my last message to you, so I was gonna go take a TikTok, and right when I was like crossing the street to do so, someone got hit by a car and it was like so sad. I was like, I feel so bad. Um, oh my gosh, my camera's gonna die. Um, but I'm gonna call it a night now because that was like really hard to watch. And since my camera's gonna die, I'm gonna stop filming. So I'll let you know what I get into and we'll check back in tomorrow. Bye. I really hope that person who got hit by a car ends up being okay. <laughs>